He's just running late. He's always late. But what on earth is keeping him? Mr. Groom? The wedding is starting. Are you ready? <gasps> You're not even dressed! Make yourself presentable. She's waiting for you.
I didn't think he was ever going to show up. <laughs> Jeez, how much hairspray did he use? I heard his bachelor party was crazy. Yeah, I didn't expect the best man. such a party animal. Guess you'll have to get the ring yourself. Sweating through his suit. Don't listen to them, honey. They're just fidgety from waiting. You're doing great. Hmm. I thought he was a lawyer. Well, he sure seems slimy enough to be. Stop! How did 
So handsome. <laughs> Nice to see you, sleepyhead. My typewriter is out of ink. We got more somewhere, right? You know Sherry from the book club? I caught her the other day eating a whole wedding cake. And nobody was getting married. Just a reminder, two weeks from now, I'll be out of town on an assignment. While you're waiting on your coffee, could you bring Stacy some milk? Soon I'll be a hundred feet tall! Honey, did you read my latest article? I got an interview with the mayor, and I tore him <laughs> apart! Verbally, I mean. <laughs> I'm working on a little side project, dear. I'm going to expose corruption in the fishing industry. And I know just the ship to sneak aboard. <laughs> that never stopped me before. <laughs> so, I was stargazing last night while you were off in the man cave, and I snapped a picture of some strange lights. It's probably just a satellite or a lens flare, but, you know, what if it wasn't? I heard some crashing from the living room, mister. You know I just cleaned it last night. Thanks for the milk, Dad. Soon my bones will be made of steel. Oh, honey, your coffee is ready, sweetie. Oh. Your 
Welcome back. Is getting long again. Might need a trim soon. I made your coffee just the way you like it. Sea salt and tartar sauce. Have you seen my Salty Hearts novel anywhere? Ouch! Oh, hush you. Oop, now that you're energized, I need you to take care of some chores in the backyard while I get some work done. There's grass to mow, weeds to pull, wood to chop, and don't forget to make burgers for lunch. <laughs> Largest in the world. <laughs> we'll just see about that. <laughs> Don't get too comfortable, dear. I've got a busy day planned for the whole family. <laughs> It's a surprise! Birds are so strange. Why do you say that, dear? If I could fly, I would just fly to the moon and live there. Three bankruptcies since opening in 1960. <laughs> Two directors in the last year. Yikes. Hmm? Oh, it's such a beautiful day today. The sun is shining, the birds are singing, the worms are wiggling. Yes, even worms are happy to be outside today. Said we could get one. Oh, he did, did he? <laughs> My camera's getting a bit old, honey. Any chance you know where to find an M1 modified for motor drives? should have seen this spiral I threw the other day. It was like 50 feet or like 100. Mm -hmm. I don't want to brag. <laughs> Stacy, why are your butterfly hair clips all over the yard? I was returning them to nature. Be careful, 
bad, don't mess up my collectibles. Tommy, why do you have so many footballs? They're all different and like special or something. Oh, now I get it. What? They're like dollies. Some are for playing house, and some are for playing space dolly, and some. No, they're not. They're not like that. <laughs> hey, Dad, I saw that crazy chef guy again. <laughs> No! Oh, my flowers! I hurt my knee at basketball practice and my elbow at baseball and my foot at... Dad, the way you're mowing the lawn reminds me of this one episode of Sports Johnson where he goes back in time and meets his son, Sports Johnson Jr. or SJJ and he and his son have to train to win the soccer match between Earth and Pluto and they do! And Dad, are we ever gonna play soccer together? Take a look. If this thing were any bigger, I'd be dead. Dad, when you chop trees, do they feel pain? Geez, Stacy, dumb things like trees and animals don't feel pain. Mm -hmm.
I've got you now! on over there. think aquariums are festering prisons of iniquity, but I've got to write an article for the paper. Can't you make an exception this time? For me? Hmm. Oh, uh, groceries. We need to go to the grocery store. We need things like cereal for the kids. Right, kids? Well, we already have cereal. We need so much cereal. Then it's settled. We're all going to the grocery store. <laughs> I want Sports Johnson cereal and pizza and soda and chocolate milk. And I want an apple. has revolutionized the modern shopping experience. Everything here is automated and handled remotely. Our freezer section is all frozen up. We're working on getting it fixed, but we're sure at least one freezer door is working. Why are all these freezers frozen? See, when the red light's on, the speaker is off. That means it's safe for me to talk about how we get our meat from... What? What is it? Oh, jeez! Uh, what I was saying was, it's safe to talk about how we get our meat from... Nowhere. Gerbison's. Picking up soda for the big game? Maybe for a big party? Only Gerbison's has a soda city big enough to handle all your biggest events. Destroy! Destroy! Hear that? Abazor action figures are back in stock by popular demand. I would get the new Abazor for my son, but I hear they promote robot violence. <laughs> the last Sports Johnson cereal. I hope nobody steals it while I look over. What are you doing?
Our deli offers a variety of creatures that can be fried, barbecued, roasted, and toasted. Stop on by. Do you work? 
back here. Oof. Oh, I'm sorry. Does anyone work here? We here at Gervison's promote family values by offering great values to great families. That nasty soda is out of this world. I drink so much milk, I think I'm utterly in love.